עכשיו אתה יכול לעשות את מה שאתה עושה. אוקיי, אז אנחנו נתחיל את הנינג'יצו כאן by discovering the utility of push-pull. How my body and my center of gravity reacts to my opponent's center of gravity. So instead of imitating form, I use utility to get into a better form. And the utility is him pushing me. So we start by push-pull like this. Okay, this is fantastic. Now, okay, what we do is do jig. Uh, you need to take a wide shot. Okay, and do jig, and go down, and go up. So we are leaning on each other and discovering our center of gravity. Because if I move, I don't want him to fall. Okay, so he fell a little bit, that's, that's fine. Okay, and again. Okay, and jig, go down, go up. Okay, so this is a preparation for single leg. Just easy does it. Now let's move on to what we are going to do. Okay, I use this arm drag and do this. So I want to slide in like butter. Okay, not like a knife, like butter. And then I just slide on his back and whoop, just change shoulders. And actually we're doing it to each other. So he slides on me and I slide on him. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so this is a Kung Fu movement, okay, that I slide in, okay, and of course, it can be done fast, but right now, I just want to do it to, to, to get a better feeling of my opponent, then what I do is I push and enter an underhook, and in the underhook, I stand, okay, in horse stance, and I don't push him forward to his forward. I pull him to my three o'clock. And we do it again just to get the hand of it. So entering, establishing lock, and, and now we combine the two exercises together. So first of all, I do guns. Now you do guns. And I move with him, still not falling, it's the beginning of the year, okay? But we will fall, but I'm reacting to his force. And then after we did it, one, two, we change shoulders, how? We slide, and not move in contact. Do the same thing on the other side. Now that's not the end of it. Because what I wanna do is, from the gun seki, I pull him, and he escaped. Why? Because I didn't do it properly or I just let him. Then I enter again into Koshi Nage. But it's not a Koshi Nage this time. It's just a exercise. And I get down and I put my knee on the floor. So now he rests all his weight on me and he does not jump, he slides. Slide, slide, slide. And he gets up and hopefully does Zanshin. And Zanshin is always with the body. So to do Zanshin, I have to use at this level my hands and my eyes and my breathing patterns. Let's do it again so we make it clearer. So I do one. Again, no Koshinagi now, just entering and he slides and he does Zanshin and just to show how easy it is to a 60 year old guy like me to behave like this, he does this and I, I do the ukemi. So he enters into Gansaki and into drop, okay? And now I just slide and I do the zanshin. And uh, that's all for today, folks. Take care.